design is all about lifestyle. So at uh, CFDM, what we believe is that the students should be given education in a form more of learning rather than teaching. Because learning never ends in a life. And design is about creativity where each one should have their individuality. And to have this individuality into this techno savvy world where there is a lot of copying and a lot of uh, digitizing and things happening, the hands-on experience and the work that goes with the mind and the process of uh, designing is a philosophy by itself. Groom the students to uh, look at uh, the larger picture um, in you know that caters to the fashion industry. So um, broadly speaking, if this is the first venture uh, at Modi University uh, setting up uh, a college of such a nature, and CFTM believes that the student need to have that appropriate attitude, ethics, quality and they have to be sincere enough in whatever they are designing. We are all set to uh, establish a USP and the unique selling uh, proposition would be that there are, you know, when you are comparing our college to uh, all the other uh, hundreds of, of fashion colleges in the, the country, uh, how do we set ourselves apart from the rest and what is it that you know we seek to attract uh, when we are addressing our students, our potential uh, admission seekers, what is it that we are offering to these young girls who are aspiring to become fashion designers. These are all the decisions which are quite crucial for a fashion designer. So. I always say that fashion is a line which is, you know, like it's a artistic science and scientific art because once you know your materials, you should know how to um, deal with them, which is the appropriate seam, what is the appropriate seam allowance, what do people like and how are you going to make functional, uh, decorative as well as, uh, you know, enhancing clothes. Because that's what, at the end of the day, people want. The curriculum of uh, CFPM has been designed in such a way that it is industry-university interface. Now this means that what the industry requires, we are making students industry ready. For this, in the curriculum, we have uh, in the seventh semester internship. Now for the internship, the students who have been taught all the uh, three years of their education where they have completed the modules of all the apparel categories uh, or if they are doing merchandising course then they have done the branding, marketing, merchandising and the related uh, market values and all or if they are doing bachelors in fashion and accessory lifestyle design they would have done all the accessory design, lifestyle product design and all which makes them ready to go and perform into whichever their choice is towards. If they want to go into couture wear, designer wear, uh, they want to go for a brand. So accordingly, they choose their internship, what they want to take a career forward in their life. And when they go there, it is like, you know, they're doing a classroom exercise. That is what an industry ready student does. That there is nothing new. The machines are the same that are used in the industry. They have worked on the software that the industry is using. And basically it is the performance which comes. They have learned what they should in the university. Now it is the time to perform in the industry. It so happens that some students function so well. They do such good work with the industry that the industry want to retain them and they want to employ them. There are so many designers who come and ask, we want your students. So this is how the students do not go for a job, but the job comes to the student. And I believe that education is all about inculcating those values in the students that they become responsible for their design. They, they want to give to the society the best. They become sensible into their art forms. And uh, 
it is always that a designer is a, you know like a mother you know nurtures gives designs and products which are uh, useful which are customized and uh, makes everybody happy especially when it comes to a region such as uh, shikhavati region you know which we represent uh, where where do we bring about this synergy of the global local um, uh, combination so that's where um, the usp comes in where, because we are um, as at modi university we are um, talking a lot about sustainability for an able institute to give proper fashion and design education what you need is experienced staff where they have got the blend of academic and industry experience and they are able to become good mentors for their students the hand holding is there then they are becoming their facilitator and at the end they become mentors where they make their students take their own decisions of design and this is how a designer is created where does the fashion scenario come into the picture uh, as far as uh, the university is concerned so this is really what we are hoping to we are addressing two areas one is uh, looking at the local crafts of the region because this is what we want to project uh, when we we talk about modi university now along with the mentors and human resource what you need is the uh, facilities that are given to the students the laboratories should have the high tech uh, technology machines uh, softwares computers and the other things which are needed are the resource center the library the wgsn uh, focus study so that everything goes hand in hand